Tom Wormy and Riley Skinner in the ACC Digital Network Studios brought to you by Ruby Tuesday. And we're talking about the game of the week, and it's those Miami Hurricanes who had that unbelievable win against NC State with that late touchdown pass against Notre Dame Riley, which is undefeated this season 4-0. Well, I think it's going to come down with these two teams is the speed of Miami, which is shown to be explosive against the front seven of Notre Dame. Notre Dame is third in the country right now in total points allowed, but the Miami offense is really coming into its own, finding a rhythm and explosive plays out of their receivers and skill positions. What I think Stephen Morris needs to do against this tough defense is be able to extend plays with his feet. He's an athletic guy. He's fluid in the pocket. But that's a good pass rush with Notre Dame. He's going to need to extend the play and find his receivers downfield, use the play action efficiently because they've got a good running game. They need to suck that defense up and try to beat them over the top with their speed. Yeah, Morris has thrown for over 1,000 yards in the last two games. How about that Miami defense? Here's the chance for them to shine. Miami defense, they're on the chopping block right now. They've been getting scrutinized, but rightfully so. I think this is the chance if they're going to show that they've got some sort of heart and they've got determination, this is where they've proven on a national stage. Notre Dame's been having a little quarterback carousel rotating through Everett Golson and Tommy Reese. They haven't really found a rhythm, so Miami needs to cause some disruption in the backfield early on, get to those quarterbacks, get them, rat them, and get them out of rhythm, or else it could be a long day for the Miami Hurricanes. All right, that's 7.30 Saturday on NBC. It is the ACC Game of the Week, Miami and Notre Dame.